Hey, how's it going? It's Annalise here, and I know I have been dragging my feet on this one, but my outfit checks are back with an autumn Stradivarius haul for 2020. some basic, some not so basic, but hopefully I'm gonna give you some autumn fashion inspiration and show you how I style my basics for this season. And if you haven't already, please do help me out by subscribing to my channel, giving this video a thumbs up and clicking that bell notification. But yes, autumn is here. And I tell you what, Stradivarius is one of those undercover stores serving up serious looks for very, very reasonable prices. So I've styled up these Stradivarius basics. We've got these joggers, which were 12 99 They come in lots of different colors. I mean, we all know, right? We learned it during lockdown. Joggers are life, right? Um, as for this vest, it is 9 99 knitted brown vest. I thought it was just a must have. And um, basically I stole my boyfriend's shirt, popped it on underneath. Now, I know boots, heels with joggers, yes, it can be a controversial choice, but I actually think that chunky heeled boots work really well with joggers. What do you think? And I said it before, gonna say it again, loads during this video, joggers are life, basics are life, so I got these two. These gray wide leg joggers, they were 19 99 and for me, these are a total staple. I think the wide leg elevates the kind of casual look that you're going for. I've opted for my custom Diverge sneakers. And you know how we all have that pile of black and white t-shirts and vests? Well, my collection was starting to look really tatty, so I decided to upgrade with this strappy cropped white top. I think it was just at $5.99. But at the end of the day, it's autumn. I think we need a shaket or a shacket, aka a shirt and a jacket. This one was $25.99. Now, what I'm really liking about this Stradivarius trio is that it's kind of casual, but kind of elevated all at the same time. However, it has been pretty nippy in London, so you could always throw on a trench coat. Now, I am definitely not gonna lie to you, this one is actually my vintage Burberry trench, but I promise you, Stradivarius has some really, really similar ones at a fraction of the price. have this problem no matter what the weather or what I'm wearing I always arrive at any station sweating yeah that's why I thought that this cutout jumper was a total essential for me it was only 19.99 I can actually see myself reaching for this quite often and pleather is always a good waterproof autumn option. This is actually the matching skirt to that shacket I showed you before. And although this dress is simple, there is nothing basic about it. Silky, chocolatey, maybe caramelly slip dress. I actually think this is the best at $17.99 that I've spent in a while. And you know what? Tomorrow is actually my birthday. In fact, it's probably today by the time I upload this. But anyway, I'm thinking that this is my birthday dress. Yes. I mean, it's my favorite look from today's video. Please do comment below and let me know yours. But since there's no nightclubs for me to twerk at, I'm probably gonna end up wearing it like this. Black polo, tights, biker boots, bum bag. Layers are always your best friend in autumn, but especially for 2020. And from my favourite item to my least. I mean, I am feeling these jeans. I've worn these quite a few times already. But um, this top, 
it looks really good on the website, but I'm just not feeling it in person. I don't know if maybe I need a bigger size or something. I'm not sure. I'm just not feeling it. And it was $19.99. Um, and considering that my favourite dress was $17.99, nope. But this bodysuit... I've said it like 10 times in this video, but basics that you can layer over and wear in lots of different ways are key for the autumn season. Like this. I just felt like the outfit needed a little bit of a zhuzh and a houndstooth is massive for autumn 2020. Another Stradivarius number for 19.99. I mean, they love that price, don't they? Anyway, it's actually a dress. Told you. Now, you could actually just pop on that black polo or even a white polo like I did earlier with that slip dress. But you know what? I'm actually quite liking it just like this with these thigh-high boots. Yes. So, yeah. That's it for my autumn Stradivarius haul. Um, thank you so much for watching. Please do let me know what other fashion videos or outfit checks you'd like to see from me, especially because fashion and styling really is a passion of mine. Please do give this video a thumbs up, hit that bell notification, subscribe to my channel and follow me on Instagram where you can really see my passion for fashion. And of course, feel free to check out my outfit check styling videos along with my ANTM recaps. Autumn Stradivarius Hall outfit check. Now, usually I'd end my outfit check videos right here, but in celebration, I thought I'd give you a little bonus and add on a mini birthday vlog. Enjoy. It's my birthday. Yes, indeed, I am turning 34 today, or I am 34 today. Now, obviously, COVID kind of messed up the plans this year. Um, can't get more than six people together at a time here in London. So I decided I wasn't going to do something major. Just basically celebrate the whole month of October. Um, doing lots of little gatherings with different friends. I'm going to dinner later, though, with my lovely honey bun, my lovely boyfriend. Um, but right now, I'm just taking myself to Westfield, yeah. So I've got a couple items from Stradivarius that I need to return. Um, and I quite like shopping. Maybe I'll buy something. Who knows? Let's see what happens. It's my birthday. This is the energy we are giving people. So I am in the Westfield Stratford car park. And I thought I'd show you my little birthday get up. All, well, I was going to say all from Stradivarius. Not all, but you'll get the gist. So I'm wearing that slip dress from Stradivarius, my Lulu Guinness crossbody bag, my Burberry trench, remember those, Stradivarius has them too, my shoe and the bear boots, love these, black polo and tights from H&M, and my Christian Olsen frames. And yes, people are looking at me. So I got on with the task at hand, first stop, Kurt Geiger. I bought my favourite biker boots about seven months ago from them. They're the same ones that feature in this autumn haul. And while filming yesterday, I noticed that one of the Diamante fastenings had fallen off. That fuming! These were £199, you know. Anyways, I spoke to the online customer service team and they said to bring them back to store. My boots and they actually come in white now, which I was very excited about. But basically, the lovely manager ordered me in a brand new pair. So obviously I had to browse while the details were confirmed. I was so impressed with the customer service at Kurt Geiger. I mean, I can't believe I got a brand new pair of boots when mine was seven months old. Birthday energy, yes. Thank you. Next up, Stradivarius. So I returned that brown rouged top, also the gray joggers. I basically have another pair that's pretty similar and it seems a bit stupid to have two and I returned that houndstooth dress, as cute as it was. The 
got me a free birthday donut from Krispy Kreme and took myself home to relax and pamper before dinner at Circolo Popolare with this one. The pizza is decadent. It was indeed. I'd say go for the nothing but the truffle pizza or the ragu taglatelli. Yum, yum, yum. Defo got to go back.